this to be a better angle. I guess it's okay. How are you guys doing? Happy Tuesday. What a strange night to do a live, right? I Well, I mean, honestly, it's a better night than when I've been doing lives recently. I, I'm glad to be back to like a week, a week, day, night. Let me zoom in a little bit here. Um, so I thought what I would do is I would do a get unready with me because I was going to do a full face of makeup. And you know what? I don't know what it is about this live and the last live I did, but I just had like shit days before, <laughs> before these lives. I'm like, I can't, I can't, I can't get on here and do a full face of makeup. I just don't want to do that. So I'm going to, I haven't done this in a long time. I'm going to do an evening skincare regimen. We're just going to like, We're just gonna breathe. We're just gonna relax. We're just gonna drink. Mm. I have a little bit extra lighting. You guys probably aren't gonna notice, but I'm hoping, I think the image is, is actually a bit brighter on this live. So that's nice. <sighs> trying to upgrade here, you know? Trying to, <laughs> trying to upgrade on a budge. Um, so, how are you guys doing? I think, I think it's been like three weeks since, or yeah, three weeks since I've done a live. Um, I don't have a moderator tonight. Chase couldn't make it, but that's, that'll probably be just fine. Um, we don't tend to have to, I don't want to like, I'm going to knock on my Ikea wood right now. We don't tend to have a lot of trolls, but who knows, right? Um, yeah. Okay. Gosh, I feel a little rusty doing about, um, Sorry. Yeah, I feel a little rusty. It's been a while. Um, I am drinking the La Marca Prosecco Rosé, which is an addiction. I'm just going to get going on my skincare like right now, because why not, right? Because I just took a shower and I have a freshly scrubbed visage. You knew I was going to break it out. Duh, of course. So I want to tell you, for everyone who's so tired of me talking about this, sorry, not sorry, because <laughs> I actually stepped away from this. I just fell off for a few weeks, probably about the amount of time since my last live. And I, guys, I notice a huge difference in my skin when I use this. I mean, even right now I'm looking at myself and I'm like, this was not how my skin looked a week ago. It was not. It's like... It's a little bit like a baby's ass right now. It really is. I mean, but we're going to, we're going to go, we're going to try to really Benjamin button this shit. You know, let's not hold back. Let's also try to, let me try to get this right because <laughs> this can be a fiasco. Okay. I got a new, oh, see shit. That's what I'm talking about. I got a new strap for this mask. Okay, this is the one thing about the mask I will say I don't love. They need to get it together with the strap situation, but other than that, okay, here we go. Letty is using her mask right now. Twins! Um, I forgot my, my straw, so I can't really, whatever. I'll refrain from drinking for a few minutes, I guess. Um, so yeah, you put this on dry skin. I always like to talk about how to use this because I feel like there are a lot of varying opinions and thoughts about that. And I used to think that I could do my skincare and put this on and I mean, you can, it's just not going to be as effective. And yes, your face is going to feel like a dry ass prune face when you put this on, but it's fine because you're going to do all your skincare afterward and your face is going to look amazing. So, um, let me scroll up. We have 80 people here. It's pretty, pretty good. Oh my God. Oh my God. Lisa loving 50 and beyond is 60 today. <gasps> Lisa, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday. Dear Lisa, happy birthday to you through a mask. 
Isn't this just what you wanted? <sighs> okay, scrolling. Aaron Doherty asks, what cleanser am I using? Okay, so thank you for asking. I have actually been exclusively using the Jordan Samuels, Jordan Samuelson skin. Wait, no. Why do I always get his name wrong? Jordan Sammy Samuel. Jordan Samuel skin. I always want to say Samuelson. Sorry. Um, I'm using his cleansers and they're incredible. I have a cream one and then a gel one. And actually, I want to talk about that because, you know, obviously like cleansers aren't something that's going to, that are necessarily going to blow your hair back, but I've been honing in more on that because I feel like when I cleanse my face, I'm kind of slapdash about it. So I've really been like focusing and taking like a minute to get into all the congested areas with the cleanser. And I'll tell you what, it helps. Um, wow, I really can't take a drink. I really can't. Well... Hold on, hold on. Okay, <laughs> I usually have a straw. I really, I really failed. Okay, much better now. Um, I know, I do need a straw. I'm scrolling up, Pink Sparkle is here. Hi, Pink Sparkle. Um, I'm just looking to see. I thought someone asked a question. Oh my God, Angie English is literally washing her face and doing her skincare with me. I love that. Sorry, I'm still scrolling up. Oh, okay, Naomi asks, I have a quick beauty question while waiting for Merit Glow Serum. I bought the Make Hiderscape and I'm not sure how to incorporate it. Oh man, I wish I wish um, Chase was here for that reason because he could tell you, but I can't because I haven't used it. I mean, now again, I'm not familiar with the Make Serum, but I'm gonna go out on a limb and just say this, a sort of a gloss over statement. Cocktailing serums, like cocktail it up. You know what I mean? Like I layer sometimes three serums on top of each other. So, I can't imagine there being any issue with the make and the merit together. Again, I don't know, but I, I feel like you can, I feel like you could. Someone correct me if they think I'm wrong. Um, okay. So let me just kind of take you through what else I'm going to be doing in this routine. It's not super extensive. I'm not doing masks and blah, 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 blah. I'm doing the mat. I'm doing this mask and then I'm going to use the Merit Instant Glow Serum. This is like what is doing it for me right now. So the Merit Great Skin. I have an eye cream from Versed that I love. It's a retinoid eye cream. I have a brand new, I mean, this brand is brand new to me and I think they are relatively new. This is called Veracity. This damn serum, it's their Bio Evolve Serum. I'm gonna read to you about it because I can't try to like put into words what this does, but this is doing wonders for my skin. It is just... <laughs> um, and then I'm gonna use a Tatcha cream and then I'm gonna Gua Sha. Oh shoot, I think I might have to go... I left it in my backpack. Okay, anyway, um, that's the plan. That's the plan as of now. So I'm just gonna, now normally I would do this for as long as I freaking can. So, you know, the last week I probably have done this four out of seven days and I try to do it for like 20 to 40 minutes. And I know that sounds excessive, but ain't gonna hurt you. I know Dr. Dennis Gross is like, oh, you only have to do like three minutes. I mean, I don't think so. I'm sorry. 
I'm sorry. I'm just going to say right now, if I did this three minutes every day, I would not be seeing quite the results I'm seeing because I've done that before and it was womp, 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 womp. So, um, so yeah, leave this on as long as you can, except not tonight because I want to drink and talk to you and we're going to shorten it. Um, okay. A few things, a few things, because I never mentioned this on lives. I want to thank, oh my God, Jamie K is here. Jamie K is here. Um, you can give this a thumbs up. I see there are only 47 thumbs up and there are 101 people here. So please, please give this a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Um, and I always like to talk about ways that you can support my channel, really support anybody's channel on YouTube. Um, you can, in the case of a live, you can send a super chat. Um, like I said, you can like, you can subscribe, you can, there's always merch options, which by the way, get excited because I am coming out with new merch very, very soon. It's pro-choice merch. So get excited. Um, Oh, see, Loving15 Beyond says, I stand in front of my panel, I'm assuming an LED panel, for 10 minutes, five days on, two days off. I love it. Wow, nice. Yes, I can. Megan, it's such an important question. I'm glad you asked it. Can you drink through a straw with this mask on? Yes, you can. I just lost both my straws. But you do have to be careful. You know, obviously, just insert it directly into your mouth. <laughs> wow, I'm, I'm telling you how to put a straw in your mouth right now. Just, you know, do it slowly. But yes, you can. Um, okay, now I'm going to take this off. All right. Now I can drink. <laughs> oh. All right, so very important. Usually I would have a mist, an essence, something like that. Well, I just ran out of my glow recipe watermelon mist. So I'm just going to use some water. Yes. So simple. You just have to have, you don't have to have, but if you want the glow serum to work its magic as much as it can, damp face because there's hyaluronic acid in here. I do two pumps. And I know that feels like a lot, but I don't care. <laughs> and I like to kind of, oh, oh, did you hear that? <laughs> Sorry if you don't like bones cracking. <laughs> Guess you came to the wrong place. Yeah, that's what I like to kind of give myself a face massage, give myself a neck massage, kind of work things out. Mm. The hooded lid is here. Yes. Hi. <laughs> Guys, this is also ASMR. Didn't I tell you? I'm just kidding, but kind of. Oh my goodness, it's been over a year since I caught a live. Hi, it's Meek13, right? Yes, I'm glad you're here. Okay. Now, eye cream. And I'm just taking, it's actually eye balm. This is the Burst Advanced Retinoid Eye Balm. Pretty much my favorite eye cream. I mean, I have like, about three favorite eye creams right now, but this is like number one and it's so affordable and it really does just glide on and makeup glides on it, uh, glides on top of it so easily. All right. Okay, so guys, what's going on? Let's talk about stuff. What are, you, what are you watching? What are you doing? Tell me things, catch me up. Okay, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go, now this part is going very quickly, but I am going to do a gua sha massage on my face, which we're gonna really take our time with. So um, I'm gonna be using the 
Veracity Bio Evolve Serum. And I'm going to pull this up. Oh, Lisa said I'm watching Shrinking on Apple TV. Oh my gosh, my friend Autumn told me that was amazing. And I need to see that. I guess maybe tonight, maybe that's what I'm doing. Okay, the Bio Evolve Serum. Let me see. Okay. Hold, please. Skincare. Okay. So this is their bestseller. And it is a bioadaptive serum powered by biomimetic copper peptides and ap aptogenic snow mushroom to energize and protect the skin. The silky fluid formula is designed to prevent and heal visible signs of aging, such as fine lines and wrinkles and promote suppleness and natural glow. And man, I'll tell you what, this, that's what it looks like. And it really is so softening. Megan, really been enjoying, oh shit. Really been enjoying your music choices for your get ready with me shorts. What music is everyone listening to? Oh my gosh, thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm throwing some shorts up because listen, we got to stay relevant. Got to do what the kids are doing. <laughs> it's really just about we have to do what YouTube is pushing out or else we suffer. But it just so happens that I love making those shorts. And what I do is I basically just film one short piece of content that's a minute and then I upload it separately to each. So TikTok, Instagram, and then YouTube shorts. So it's like more beam for my buck. Not, I will say not everyone on Instagram watches YouTube and vice versa. So it's a really nice way to sort of like kind of broaden my audience. I know not everyone loves shorts, but what are you gonna do? It's what's happening. Wait, is Chase here? Oh my God, Chase is here. Hi, Chase. Chase, Chase is like moving today. So Chase, Chase gets a pass. Chase, you don't have to be there if you need <laughs> to do things. Mm. Renee Horde, trying to decide whether to retire or not. Do I keep teaching or relax? Oh, wow. I'm not sure I can make that call. <sighs> that is a debacle. Thank you for, thank you for being a teacher. That needs to be said. Oh, hi, Lisa. Guys, are you watching The Last of Us? If you aren't, shame on you. <laughs> Shame on you. It's so good. It's, you know, it's heavy, but worth it. And honestly, I'm going to say it again. If I might be being repetitive here, but like, honestly, some of the best episodes of television I have seen in years. Chase, I made it home. I'm high eating Chipotle on the floor. Yes. Chipotle on the floor. Hi, we love it. Melanie Murkowski is here. Hey, girl. Jamie. Oh, Jamie. Oh, I see she's talking. Okay. Fenland, Fenland says, I don't, I know you'll say every brand, but do you have any brand specifically that you wish were more vocally pro-choice? Oh, man. I mean, I'm not, I, I'm not going to say every brand. I mean, yes, of course, of course we want every brand, but it's a lot of brands. Um, hold on a second. Guys, here, here's a little something. If you ask a question and particularly if it's personal and you keep asking again and again, thinking I don't see it, it feels really intense and abrasive. So please don't do that. If you do, I'll put you in, I'll put you in a timeout. I feel so dumb saying that. Why do they call it a timeout? That's so dumb. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, 
Um, I'll name some brands that I wish that I like particularly top of the list, which were vo wish were vocally pro choice. Charlotte Tilbury, Kosas, Chantecaille, Westman Atelier, House. I mean, I could go on. House Labs, um, Hourglass, uh, any drugstore makeup. Period. Uh, those are top of mind. <laughs> So yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with the Tatcha Dewy Skin Cream. So I am so crazy about Tatcha that I have both of these. Okay. <laughs> this is really a splurge for me. No, I'm sorry. Actually, to, that's right. Tatcha sent me this one. I purchased this one. Um, I just love them both. And this is definitely a little bit more thick and rich. Bonnie Namison, Charlotte Tilbury should be, and I don't understand why she isn't. Well, I do because she sucks. She's French. She's still, I mean, from what I know, she still associates with JK Rowling. She named a lipstick after her, which I, I still think you can purchase. At least you could a while back. Um, Charlotte Tilbury's highly problematic person. <laughs> Not a fan. And I really haven't been a fan ever since I read how public she was about how she refuses to go to bed without makeup because she doesn't want her husband to see her without makeup. No. That's a no. <laughs> okay, got it. We're back in 1945. Understood. Wow, sorry. <laughs> Lots of opinions on Charlotte Tilbury. Lily Phoebe is here. Hi, welcome. Um, the hype for me, the hype with Charlotte Tilbury was that it was it was incredible product to me. I mean, I really did. I, th I think, I, yes, it's expensive, but I, I owned so much of it and most of it was entirely worth it to me. Um, and it was mighty, mighty painful giving all that away. I probably gave away, who knows, um, $1,500, $2,000 worth of Charlotte Tilbury products. Anyway, okay, this is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to go, oh, never mind. My backpack is right here. I don't have to go into the kitchen to get it. Okay, so this is like the exciting moment for me. This is a brand new tool. I am obsessed with it. This is a gua sha stone. It is a little bit different from your normal gua sha stone. It is a gua sha wand. So this is called the Empress Wand and it's from Wild and Beauty. And I do want to tell you that all the products I'm using tonight are linked in the description box. If I do persuade you to perhaps purchase these products, I would so appreciate it if you would use my links because it's literally what keeps my channel going. It's how I can do this. So thank, to, thank you to you guys in advance. But this, um, this is magic. And I'll tell you what, if you have TMJ, you're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. So <clears throat> how I like to, I mean, I'm still getting used to it, but how I like to use it it's very like ergonomic. Is that the right word? And it literally like carves into your face. <laughs> Melanie, yes, Wilding Beauty, the place I get facials at uses their products and they are so delicious. Yes. I'm just gonna keep reading you guys' comments while I do this. <laughs> Sorry, I need both my hands to do this. So hold on, I read that.
Yes, exactly. Jamie K says Charlotte Tilbs makes some dope powder products. Still looking for a new bronzer to replace hers, but yeah, she's one I had to let go of. Thanks, Jamie K. Agreed. Couldn't agree more about the bronzer. That bronzer can have, could have its way with me when I owned it. Um, but I will tell you, I, I'm not going to say it's a, a dupe, but I think that the quality of this product is very close to Charlotte Tilbury's bronzer, which is the, uh, the Jones Road powder bronzer that they just came out with. It is gorgeous. Don Carpenter, the wand looks smoother than using a shiny, a skinny gua sha that can scrape sometimes. Yeah, it is. It's got very smooth surfaces. I mean, it has a wider surface too, so you could use this too, but I just find that I can kind of get in the nooks and the crayons better like this. And I also have a normal gua sha as well, like, you know, probably what you're used to seeing. But the thing I love about this is like the the smoothness and the pressure it provides. Like when you get into your temple, I forget how much I forget how much tension is up here. Oh my God, it's so tender and painful. <laughs> okay, I'm not stressed at all. Yeah, not at all. And like the brow, so I went to get a facial. Um, I had a bunch of class pass credits I had to use up before I canceled it for now. And it was at this spa in Midtown East. It's called Yihan Spa, um, which I'll link down below if you're ever in New York. I got the most incredible hour-long facial from this woman named Tina at Yihan Spa. I was like in another universe. It was wild. I mean, it wasn't even about the products she used because it, you know, they're not bougie products, but the things she did to my face. I mean, she got in there, she gave me a full facial, facial massage. She got into like my eye sockets and like my brows and like put pressure on. I was like putty in that woman's hands. Wow, I, I'm going back for sure. Mm, the hooded lid. I used to have tenderness in the temple area as well. I started doing lymphatic massage and after a week or two, it cleared up. Wow, fascinating. So I think I could use this like broader surface for my forehead. Wait, I'm, I need to go back up. I missed things. I missed things. <laughs> Lily, Phoebe, Kate, have you been getting more business with pro-choice beauty brands? Because I know... It was a little bit of a struggle at first. I wrote to Rare Beauty telling them everything I thought, everything I bought was because of you. Oh my God. <laughs> that is so above and beyond. Thank you for doing that. Um, getting more business. It, it, sorry. <laughs> I'm like, uh, I can't talk. It's still a struggle. It's still a struggle. But what I will say is, yes, I want to acknowledge that I think the pro-choice brand, there are certain brands that are very much aware of the pro-choice list, brands that are on it, of course. And I feel like the response I've gotten from some of those brands is fantastic. And I've also had an interaction with a brand that I'm not gonna talk about right, you know, I'm not gonna name right now, but it was a very heartening interaction. And it's a brand that I love. And I wrote to them and I, I know the owner personally. And they were so, and this is a person who's, the owner's a, a man. Hopefully I can talk about this at some point, but I just wanna be careful. Um, and he was so willing to listen to what I was saying and like literally went back and asked me questions and was like, wait, is, 
So now are you saying that if we come out and we just talk about women's rights, that's not enough. We need to say the word abortion. And I was like, yes, yes, thank you. I like literally got a chill down my spine. I was like, this is what needs to be happening. And he was like, I get it now. He's like, thank you so much for educating me. It was, it was like incredible. And it really brought tears to my eyes because I was like, if more people and more brands could do that, and I, again, I want to say, this is, this is not a woman, this is a man. You know what I mean? Like ec extra st stars, really. Extra stars. <laughs> um, so impressed. So impressed. It's, and I, it's just, it points out like how, how much better it could be if people would just stop being so fucking scared of standing up for other people. My God, it is so hard for everyone, isn't it? Sorry, I'm just like really filled with piss and vinegar today, like extra. <laughs> Thanks, Renee, I just read your comment. I, I'm kind of like back up in the comments. I had to scroll back up. Um, Oh, Jennifer Dobbins said, I'm loving the Jones Road bronzer. The dusty pink tone is great for my cool, light, medium skin tone. Yes, exactly. It's like a really, really, um, for me too, I'll speak for myself. It is a, a really great shade. Um, Crystal Smith, is everyone looking forward to the Oscars? I mean, I will be watching the Oscars, like, absolutely. And we're trying to like, we, you know, we try to see as many movies as we could. I don't know if we're gonna make it <laughs> like all the you know the best film movies but we're gonna try to watch maybe a couple more you know um <laughs> lily phoebe oh my gosh you're so sweet so funny um oh god love my gsds i am filled with vodka after having jury duty today wow <laughs> jury duty love my gsds slow clap Um, mm, Laura B. Yes. And learning all the mental clarity and struggle that goes with abortion. Thank you for bringing it to the table. Yeah, absolutely. Um, fierce over 50. I tried to watch tar today and fell asleep. LOL. <laughs> I mean, I, yeah, I can see that. Got lots of opinions on that movie. <laughs> So I know it looks like, oh wow, Kate's face looks a little beaten and red, but this is just, you know, it's fine. This is, this is good for it. And you know what feels, it's like the temples. And for me, it's this, it's like the cheekbone. Ooh, God, that feels so good. And you wouldn't think that, but damn. Am I holding tension in my cheekbone? How? How? <sighs> Laura, Kate, if you're up for it, tell us about your bad days. St share your struggle bus with us. Oh my God. Well, I mean, honestly, it, it was kind of just a bunch of little things. So it's, it, it'd be kind of boring. <sighs> but you know, I, I work part-time um, at a Pilates studio. Have I told you guys this? Probably not. Yeah, no, I probably have. Um, <laughs> I on and off worked there, like in the pandemic, obviously I wasn't there, but like, it's kind of a unicorn job. It's an incredibly um, small boutique, fancy Pilates studio. And no, I don't give a shit about Pilates. So don't even ask me. Um, it's just this great job where I can basically do my thing, edit my videos, do what I need to do at the desk and still interact with clients. And it's just kind of perfect. So I work there two to three days a week. And, um, nothing. It's just like the clientele is just like really, really wealthy. And 
you know, whatever. There's some people who really suck and some people who are fine. And there's a woman who came in today and she's very sweet. She's very nice. Okay. But like, nothing. It's just, she's been coming for years and I have to collect payment. And I don't understand people who give people a hard time about like doing their job and collecting payments. Sometimes I feel like with clients, I'm like walking on eggshells asking for payment for their literal session. <laughs> and I needed to get home to this live, okay? And I stayed like 30 minutes, ex 25 to 30 minutes extra because she just she just wasn't getting the hint. She was like, take, she was like luxuriating and like her session was over. She was taking all the time and like doing an extra workout, which like isn't really allowed. And I'm just sitting over there like, I've got a live stream to get home to. But I was like trying to just, whatever not make it a thing and i was like hey so um just need to you know i'm just gonna leave so i'm just gonna grab your payment when you get a chance just always trying to find a way to say it in a way that isn't like abrasive and this woman just always has such a hard time with payment like every time she has to pay she's like no wait what now what's that for now what is that and i'm just like you have been coming here for four years, bitch. Like, what do you mean? I am like dying and I'm just like, <sighs> anyway, that's really the story. It was, it was actually a lot more annoying than that, but I'm just going to like avoid some detail, but I just, and then I was late for this and then I came home, whatever you get the picture. It's just like, <sighs> I'm not saying that rich people shouldn't care about you know, where their money's going or what they're paying for. But like, if you saw the clientele I was working with, you would have zero sympathy. <laughs> you just would. So anyway, again, like perfect example of like super nice, but totally clueless, just completely unaware, just every, it's all her like she's in orbit essentially and i just anyway whatever you get the picture <laughs> oh no i got payment don't you worry because also i'm not gonna get in trouble for that shit. <laughs> you best believe okay so i'm gonna stop and give my face a rest. <laughs> Jacqueline Mark Marquez, dude, sometimes you gotta get abrasive. Jacqueline, you know what? I Before I came on here, I looked, I scrolled up and I saw what happened today about you putting your dog down and I'm so, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. So Jacqueline, I'm sending you all the, all the love. Ugh. That's awful. Um, yeah, oh, Chantal's like, she didn't realize she needed to pay her bill. No, she does, but she like always is like, now what? Now, why does it cost that? And I'm like, what? <laughs> I've gotten to a point where I'm like, you just, I'm like, you, you're going to have to take it up with the owner. You're going to have to take it up. <laughs> Because I, I don't, I didn't set the prices. I just didn't. Why don't they pay when they're entering? Well, because we are, I am a lovely customer service person who I feel out the situation when someone comes in. So if they're rushed and they're running late, I'm not going to be like, can you pay? So like I let it happen, but then at the end I will be, you know what I mean? So I just kind of like feel it out with every client. You get me? Megan, I check out my clients and all of my stylists. Me at the front desk. Yes, you need to pay for the services you received today. <laughs> oh, anyway. Um, it's so, okay. So now I'm going to... Oh, that's what I wanted to do. This is the last step I wanted to do. I probably could have put it on before the gua sha, but honestly, the dewy skin cream is so incredibly dewy and so slippery. 
that I kind of didn't need an oil for the gua sha, but I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be extra. This is gonna be the last step. So this is the Ritual de Fee Thorn Oil Priming Facial Elixir. Somehow this doesn't smell. I just, I tried their crushed jelly facial balm and it smelled a little, it didn't smell great, but this actually smells really nice. So Hey, do you ever get any good tips at the Pilates studio? Oh, no, 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 there's no tipping. No, I don't, do people tip desk people at boutique fitness studios? I don't think so. I, I mean, that would be weird. I don't, I don't expect that. I just expect people to not be. Idiots. I don't know. Um. <laughs> Okay, so I want to show you, like, I learned this technique, and you're like, is Kate's, is Kate just going to, like, massage her face away tonight? Is she going to have a face by the end of it? By the end of this. Um, so I'll have to find the account that I follow on Instagram. I think it's called Noi Skincare, N-O-Y, and I believe she's New York City based. And she does great facial massage tutorials. So... I watched this tutorial today where this is how she lifts. And this is basic. I mean, it feels a lot better to have someone else do this to you. Let me tell you. But like, so you don't even need, you really don't even need a gua sha stone. Like you can literally, like this feels like oh, heaven. And sometimes you can really get in there in ways you can't with a stone. So this is great too. You wanna make sure there's like a nice slip to it. Like when I was at the facial, this one is like, brr, 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 like just like magic fingers, it was wild. So I'm gonna to try to like hone that technique a little bit more. Obviously again, not as good as when someone is doing it to you, but so I know this seems super short. We're coming up in 45 minutes here, and I know I usually do longer live streams, but this is pretty much the routine. Um, and I'm probably going to keep it a little shorter today because it was a long day, guys. Um, but I, I also try to want to go less time in between lives. I know I've really been slack on, slacking on that. And um, I'm going to try to do more weekday night live streams if I can. So my aim is always to do like a live stream, a full length video and a short in a week. That's the goal. Um, yeah, go follow Noise Skin Noise Skin Care on Instagram. Um, I've learned so much from her. Okay, guys, I barely drank anything, but I think this is the end. Short and sweet, right? Um, again, I want to point out. The, oh my God, Bratterstein is here right at the end. What a treat! Hey, Brittany, miss you, girl. Um, you didn't miss it. You made it, we're done, but you made it right at the end. So anyway, I just want to thank you guys so much again. Uh, you know, please give this a thumbs up on your way out. And, uh, that's that, that's that. So cheers, you guys, like when I say stay safe out there, that's just not something I say at the end of my videos, just to say it. Like I, it has grown in meaning in these times. So please stay safe out there and cheers till next time. Bye.